Hatred does not cease by hatred, but only by love, this is the eternal rule. Once upon a time, there was a monk who taught people how to be happy and peaceful. Deva, his cousin, was jealous of his spiritual growth and fame. Deva was very angry with the monk and tried more than once to kill him. Deva was a man who couldn't see past his own ego, and was stuck in the darkness of his hatred and jealousy. His heart used to be full of brotherly love, but now all he could think about was surpass the monk spiritually, dethroning him, and overcome him. Each time Deva tried to hurt the monk, the monk looked at him with a gaze full of compassion, radiating a warmth that seemed capable of melting away even the coldest of hearts. He never got back at them, and he never let his anger show on his face. Instead, he kept being kind and understanding, hoping that Deva would see that what he was doing was pointless, and hurting only himself. One day, Deva got very sick and his life force went down quickly. When the monk heard that his cousin was in trouble, he ran to help him. He looked after Deva attending to his needs, soothing his pain, nurturing him with love and compassion. People who knew that Deva didn't like the monk were confused by what they saw, but the monk didn't find it strange. The monk saw this as a chance to show Deva the transformative power of love over hate, kindness over cruelty. As Devdutta's illness got worse, he lay weak on his sickbed, and the monk's hand gently touched his hot forehead. In those quiet moments, Deva felt the warmth of the monk's kindness seep into his own heart, melting away the icy tendrils of hatred that had held him prisoner for so long. All of it flashed before Deva's eyes, his attempts to kill the monk, his cousin's constant kindness in response, and the monk's unwavering care when he was in trouble. With tears running down his face, Deva whispered an apology, seeking forgiveness for his misguided hatred. The monk took his apology with a gentle nod and a calm face. His actions showed that true power came from forgiveness and love, not from being in charge or being mean. This old story is still very important in our current world. We often meet people who are mean, unfair, or hostile. But instead of doing the same, the story tells us to find the strength to reply with kindness and compassion. It tells us that we already have compassion, and shows how we can develop it to get rid of hostility and grow harmony. The story of Monk and Deva is an amazing story that inspires us. The story that teaches us how to turn hate into love, and how to use the power of compassion when someone is mean to us. This story shows the old rule that, hatred can only be stopped by love, not by more hatred. As we go through the hard parts of life, let's keep this rule in mind, keep it close to our hearts, and use it to turn hate into love. Because, hatred cannot be stopped by hatred, it can only be stopped by love.